The Cajal del Rio Recreation Area is located just outside of Santa Fe. This was the last night of our vacation we spent in this free dispersed camping area. It turned out to be really nice. Um, I did look on the forest website though and the area is closed right now for wildfires. So make sure you check ahead if you are going to be going. It had a lot of open space for rigs and plenty of parking. This is Mike walking towards the van. We parked um, just close to some trees so we could kind of be, have a little bit of a barrier from the wind. This area is windy and I also imagine that it gets quite muddy or dusty depending on the weather. Um, when we were there it was nice and it was windy but it was cool and it wasn't super dusty. I have read some reviews online that says it's very dusty depending on the time of year you go. We really like this because there's a great bike path along here that you can ride on. We spent about an hour on it just riding back and forth. Uh, there's a lot of ATV and motorcycle trails around here as well. So if you're into outdoor activities, this is the perfect dispersed camping and you can't be free. And the bike path actually continues in and out of the campground, so in the next part here you'll see us pulling in to the campground on our bikes. As you can see here as we're riding, some of the sites do have numbers, and you can pull into these sites. Um, that's a designated camping spot. There are a lot of spots though around here that aren't designated, and you can just pull wherever. Um, you know, just try to give people privacy as you can and be courteous. Also, if you have a bigger rig when you pull in, make sure you go to the left because the road is smoother on the left. If you go to the right, there's a lot of um, ruts and so forth. Um, this night, Mike and I were just super tired. We just had some snacks in the van, um, made up a little quick, convenient dinner, and just enjoyed the evening. Uh, we tried to be outside as much as possible. The wind kind of got to us, so we did a quick walk around as you can see here and we spent a lot of time in the van just chilling out as this was the last night of our vacation. I'm walking towards the van here and behind me is the big area without the designated spots that people can just pull into. I would imagine any size rig can really fit back here. You do have to be careful of the road on the other side just because it gets rutted out. But this is a great area for everybody to enjoy. Just make sure you clean up after yourself. We did see a lot of trash that we picked up. All right, guys, that is the end of the video series on our New Mexico trip that we took in April. I know it took me a long time to put it together, but life just gets crazy. I am going to be doing some trips this summer. Um, I do have one coming up this weekend that I'm going to do with my nephew. I'm really looking forward to that. So we will um, be posting and sharing where we go and what we do. Um, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one.